Susanna Wesley is the mother of one of church history's greatest dynamic duos. Uh, John and Charles are their mother's sons. She is the person who was responsible for their education and spiritual formation. United Methodist historians say the fathers of the Methodist movement owe much of their success to their mother and the foundation built in their childhood home. She had a spreadsheet before there were spreadsheets. She had an incredible organizational schedule for their dressing and changing clothes. Born in 1669, Susanna Wesley was the youngest of 25. At age 19, she married Church of England pastor Samuel Wesley and bore 19 children. Managing a home took great planning, but she made time to nurture each child. She would mark out at least an hour, and so it might well be that Tuesday at 3 was a time that was exclusively devoted to John, let's say. Uh, now, it wasn't mean she ignored him the rest of the week, but it meant that was their time to sit down and be together. And she did that with all of her children. Susanna led by example. Her life and faith journey shaped Methodism in ways we see today. We see in her and in her sons this tension between Puritan evangelicalism and um, Church of England prayer book order spirituality and sacramentalism. And I think we Methodists are best when we are both and and not either or. Long before women were ordained, Susanna would sometimes gather friends around the kitchen table and lead prayers while her preacher husband was away. She kept the parish going in his absence. That was actually pretty radical. Uh, now today, a family devotion with friends, we wouldn't think anything about it. In the 18, early 18th century, and her argument was there was no one else to read. It needed to be done for the good of the people. I'll do it. Susanna also planted the unconventional idea of letting lay people serve as local preachers. When John started traveling the circuit and preaching, he was late and he shows up and a gentleman that he knew, a layman, was filling in for him. Well, he was aghast. A layman, kind of almost preaching. Well, you know who told him to take another look? His mother. And he listened and he realized, this guy's doing a good thing. That changed the character of our Methodist revival. Susanna Wesley is a major difference maker. And the differences that she made have lived on from the history of the 17th and 18th century well into the present moment because of the sons that she raised. <laughs>